Hey, hey, what is up, Rush Tube? Andrew Rooney here. I'm a full time drummer and drum teacher here in Auckland, New Zealand. We are continuing our journey, our magical tour through Rush Week. Now, this one was actually a pick, it was a casual Patreon pick for Thomas Babayan. Now, with my Patreon members, they'll often make requests. They're not guaranteed requests, but in this case, it's Rush Week, so I'm going to get to it. Now, Thomas wrote here, Hey Andrew, I'm interested in suggesting another Rush reaction for you to do. I'm not sure how you're doing these. Uh, he's talking about Patreon and PayPal. We're going to do it anyway. This song is called Red Barchetta. Red Barchetta? Barchetta? Barchetta. It's off of their most popular album, Moving Pictures, which you have already done a few song reactions of. The song is about a magazine article Neil read where motorized vehicles were banned in the future. Like your typical Rush song, the time signatures shift pretty often, but the fills Neil does in the song are pretty amazing. Although the lyrics are not philosophical or deep, the poetry of the story is a true testament to Neil's songwriting abilities. Now Thomas has provided links here. Uh, we will get to the isolated drum track from the studio recording of the album and he sent me a lyric video I'm gonna go with the live video it's just a bit more visually interesting I think for a video so I hope that's okay Thomas remember if you do enjoy the channel please consider subscribing when we had hundred K subscribers I'm gonna do another rush week and remember you can pick up your free 30 day trial with Drumio, link in the description. Drumio is your one stop shop for anything Rush related. Every single Rush song ever played, ever recorded, transcribed note for note over at Drumio. Go check it out. All right, this is Rush Red Barchetta Live Time Machine Tour DVD Cleveland 2011. Let's hit it. some graphics. So much to take in here. I mean, we've got Getty just going up into that crazy high register. I need to hear Getty's talking voice. Has he got a just a naturally high voice? Really crazy high. A lot. We've got pedals going over here with Alex as well. A pretty serious um, pedal board. And yeah, we've just got a band in total sync, in total harmony. And um, yeah, Neil... As you'd expect, he's just rocking it back there on the kit. Doing the job. Don't you really 
you know that is really how you build intensity and excitement in a rock band uh, I know Rush is probably a lot of people say more than a rock band it's, it's almost like a fusion or definitely progressive kind of thing as well but just that build an intensity from note density you see when Neil puts his foot down he'll just change gear hey no pun intended with Red Barchetta he'll just change gear into a different subdivision or a different yeah intensity level and no one does it better than Neil I'm just going to back it up Check out the gear shift here in the second. High, low, Tom, I don't know what sizes Tom start at, or Roto Tom's perhaps on the left. That high, low, descending 16th note Tom fill, trademark Neil Pear. I'll be disappointed if I didn't hear one of those at least in every song. <laughs> The clocks and the dryers. Ah, oh. like I know I'm out of the loop. I am ridiculously late to the party with Rush. So yeah, I'm out of the loop with the Rush and jokes. But oh my god, that's hysterical. The dryers and the where's the chickens? We've got chickens rolling in this one. <laughs>
<laughs> oh my god. Man, that crowd just enraptured with the music, with the heroes up on the stage, laying down, you know, this highest of the high level live performance. And I'll probably go on about it way, way too much on the channel where I just really, really appreciate this live performance that we get. You know, so often now we get so many tracks in live shows. Well, quite often it's not it's not live at all because sometimes it's just total, totally miming. And, you know, you can see this is live. And as three guys playing rock music, having a party, you can tell the chemistry is great. Good friends. Everyone's in the zone. The crowd are beyond into it. And it's just a good time. And yeah, I don't know what to say. There is a lot of... It's an understatement. There are a lot of Rush songs to get to. I'm miles behind the eight ball. And um, yeah, I can tell... Yeah, there's just going to be so much stuff. When I did the Brendan Taves 175 Rush songs, I'm not sure when it was John Rutsey. I think well, I think it was John Rutsey. Uh, when he must have left for whatever reason, you know, the, the style changed. The sound did change for me on the drums. Um, it felt like it got a little bit more technical. Just going off that evolution in the band. Um, so, yeah, I just... I need to dig in. I need to go through, you know, spend a couple of days and go through chronological order every Rush song, I think. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Remember, it is Rush Week. If you want another Rush Week, consider subscribing when we hit 100k subscribers, which will be mind-blowing amount of subscribers for me. We'll do another Rush Week. I'll catch you tomorrow for the isolated studio drum take for Red Bachetta. Catch you then.